Is it a bird? Is it a plane? No, wait, it's Batman. Oh, jeez. So, you want to be a Batman inside of Robloxian High School. Well then, you've come to the right place. And not only can I show you how to become Batman, I can also show you how to summon in the Batmobile. Uh, I don't think that's the Batmobile. Ta-da! I told you I could summon in the Batmobile. Wait, what do you mean that's not the Batmobile? You never seen the Batmobile before, kid? Jeez. As you can see, guys, I have created the coolest looking Batman inside of Roblox in high school, hands down so far. Unless you're like a dog or something, then pause down. Dinner! Wait, did my mom just call me for dinner? But usually when she calls me for dinner, she says, Dinner, 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 Batman! Okay, I'm gonna stop with the jokes. I'm sorry. Anyway, you guys have clearly clicked on this video because you want to become Batmobile with the Batma bike inside of Roblox in high school because you clearly didn't come here for my terrible jokes. So guys, grab your cape, grab a mask, and let's flip and become Batman. And why is my bike moving by itself? That is so weird. So as you guys can see, I have created the coolest badass superhero inside of Robloxian High School. Guys, let me know down below who your favorite superhero is. Just leave a comment and I will see it. I might even reply. But yes, let's begin this transformation, guys. I want to start off by saying this looks really easy to do, but it's not. And if you can do this, then guys, you seriously need to pat yourself on the back. But not so hard that your teeth fall out, because that would be really scary. Okay, so guys, the first step that we need to do is click the reset avatar button at the bottom of the screen. And what will happen is you will transform back into your original avatar. This is my avatar. I know. He's incredibly handsome. You don't have to tell me. What do you mean I'm not handsome? You big bully? You big meanie? Oh, yeah. And hey, mom. And guys, once you have said hello to your mom and reset your avatar just like I have, then you are ready to begin this transformation. So what we're going to do is we're going to begin by removing everything we are currently wearing. So as you can see right now, I have a huge harrow in my head and stuff. You know, I got like weird hats and stuff on. To remove whatever you are wearing, simply come over to the tuning selection and click all the boxes that are right there. You may have five. You may have two million and five. Just get rid of those boxes and you are your original incredibly handsome self so what we're going to do next guys is come over to the body selection which is next to wearing and once you have done that you are ready to start equipping your batman body so the first thing you need to do is come over to the faces selection where you're going to want to equip a face called pal face it looks just like that guys simply search pal face if you need to it's a big old cheesy grin and yes once you have equipped that you are ready to move on to the next step which is changing the body to make him buff so to do that guys come to where it says right arm and simply search superhero and uh, make sure you spell it right and if you do you're gonna equip this one right here it's like the big circle one with circular hands not the one with thumbs and fingers equip that for both the right arm the left arm and also the torso which rhymes and also go to the right leg and equip the one without the boot for both one has a boot one does not and once you've done that we're gonna make him look like he loves the gym i love my life Oh, whoa, I think I got carried away a little bit then. And once you have him looking all gymified, it is time to come over to the color selection where you're going to want to come to this palette down here. Click any of his arms, click to the middle to make it like a uh, grayscale, and then come down and make it dark. Do that for both arms, guys. Just make it dark and come to the middle just like that. And you should have two black arms just like that. That. Then, guys, come to the scaling selection, click advanced, make him taller, open up the width, make the upper body width bigger and the lower body width smaller. And as long as you look roughly like this, you have done a cracking job. Next, guys, we want to equip our Batman clothes. So, to do that, come back to the wearing selection where you're going to want to click pants, click custom pants. A magical box falls down from the sky. You know what? I think it might come from that blimp in the sky. I mean, where else is it coming from? It's like a, a bird in the sky just dropping it down or something. Guys, copy the following code I have just put on the screen. And once you have done that, click where just like this. And it will give you this amazing Batman costume. But wait. Hold on a minute, little kiddo. You need to also equip a shirt as well. So click custom shirt and you need to input a following code just like we did before. Guys, 
Pause the video if you need to, and, uh, yeah, click where once you have copied the code, and it will give you this full-on Batman costume. Now, I know what you're thinking. That looks more like Bald Man, not Batman, but hang on a minute. Look, I get it. He's bald, okay? You don't have to be mean. Second of all, we haven't even made his helmet yet. So, to do this, guys, is where things might get a little bit tricky. What we need to do is come to the hat selection and we need to search for a few things. So the first thing we need to search for is the Black Knight helmet. It's this one right here, guys. Equip that. Then you're going to want to search for the Feared Skull of Attorney's Doom. So just search Feared Skull and it's the only thing that comes up. Finally, come to the hair selection where you're going to want to search claw and it's the only available option Once you've done that guys come to the tuning selection and we're gonna start by making the top too small and working on the claw brawler So to do this all you need to do is come to the scaling selection and make it tall and then make everything else a little bit smaller Kind of like this guys copy these settings and then uh, just bring this down a little bit like this Guys, as long as you've copied those settings, you've made them look a little bit like Wolverine, you're doing a good job. Just sort of play about with the settings so that it looks roughly like that, like this little weird hairstyle or two ears on his head. And once you've done that, you now need to play about with the feared skull of Attorney's Doom. So I recommend making it bigger until you can see it like that. Open up the rotation and you're going to want to bring it down just like that. If you look at exactly what I did there, I just bring it down, then bring the position of it back. Guys, if I'm going too quick for you, simply pause the video and just play about with the settings until you get something that you like. And this could take a while, trust me, I would know. I've literally spent ages doing this. And then you need to play about with the settings afterwards as well, just to get it looking perfect. But as long as it looks roughly like that at the minute, you're doing a good job. Give yourself a pat on the head. Now that we have done that, we need to come to where it says a Black Knight Helmet. Make this bigger. And now we need to play about with these settings as well, guys. This is kind of awkward to do. But you kind of want to make it so it's uh, thick like that. And open up the position and bring it to the back a bit. Guys, this one takes a while to do. Make it wider. Make it less thick. Kind of just play about with the settings. Make it less tall. Uh, bring it down. Like, guys, this one takes a while. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to do it. And you guys just copy the settings afterwards. But something like that is absolutely fine, guys. Pause the video if you need to copy my settings. But as long as you look roughly like this with a big old square head, you did an amazing job. And seriously, that was the hardest part of this tutorial. So if you've done that, you almost look like Batman. There's just a few things missing. The first thing that we need to do to really complete this look is come to the face selection and simply search 8-bit just like this guys and you're going to want to equip these goggles right here you're probably thinking but Callie uh Batman does not wear goggles like that and let me tell you something all right first of all don't ever talk to me like that again all right mister second of all yes he flippin' does. He just wears them under his mask so you don't see them. And you're probably thinking, well, I've seen Batman's eyes. No, you haven't, okay? I'm d uh, no, you haven't, okay? You think you've seen his eyes, but you've actually seen, uh, grapes. Yeah, they're grapes under, under, under... <laughs> so guys, I don't know what I'm talking about. Once you have that, uh, equip this, make it smaller, open the scaling of it up, make it taller, bring the position of it down and back a little bit, kind of like this. And guys, this is going to take some playing about with, maybe make it a bit wider, uh, a bit less tall. And yeah, this is just like playing about with it until you get these settings that you want. I'm going to say something like that looks good. Maybe bring it down a little bit. And guys, that is basically the look you are going for. You want these to sit inside of his eye. I had to bring the rotation of these down a bit. Then bring them up. Guys, pause the video if you need to copy the settings. But as long as all of his eyes are white like mine are. And they don't look like flipping grapes. Then you've done a good job next we need to come back over to the face selection guys where we're going to want to search for something called green snake eyes it's this one right here equip it press tuning make it as small as possible and all this is to do is to cover up that lump in his nose is like a weird bit of nose showing and what we're going to do is cover that up so to do that guys simply bring this to the front and then bring it down a little bit you literally just want to cover that up as literally minimal as possible just like that and it literally gives you that amazing batman look now guys let's be real i understand that the batman symbol there looks a little bit like a ladybird i get it 
I understand that his helmet doesn't match collars. And I understand that tree has been flipping looking at me for the last five minutes. But you know what I really don't understand? Why Batman's cape is stuck to his butt. Like, it looks like his butt has eaten his cape. So what we need to do is equip a cape for Batman. And guys, this is so easy to do. Simply come to where it says back, clear anything you have, search up there. And what you're going to want to equip is... The Guardian of the Night Cape. It's even called the Guardian. Like, for real, like, Batman Guardian, you know? Guys, once you have equipped the Guardian Cape, you're probably thinking, that looks nothing like Batman's cape. Well, hold on. Let me show you something. Come to tuning, guys. Open up the scaling. Make it as tall as possible. Make it less wide. And make it less deep, like that, or whatever you call it. I can't see, because this is in the way. Thick, I think it's called. Once you've done that, come to the position of it. And bring it down, just like that. And you can literally leave it like that. If it's poking out the front, just bring it up a little bit. Or bring it to the back, just like I just did. And there we have it. You have the most amazing Batman cape. You can't tell me that does not look exactly like... Like Batman. And guys, if you don't like the way that Batman runs, walks, smiles, or looks, you can change literally anything. I also recommend maybe equipping a different animation, maybe the superhero one to give him a more plump look. But yes, guys, that is going to be it from me today. I think we made an amazing looking creation today, guys. You've all been asking for it. I finally did it because I love you guys. I'm just going to have to say it right now, guys. You have been killing it with the support recently. I'm so proud to have you guys guys as my viewers honestly you're just so cool every single one of you you're just cool it's, it's that simple you're just flipping cool all right but yes guys that is going to be it from me today if you guys did enjoy this video then hit the subscribe button what are you waiting for alternatively leave a comment or suggestion in the comment section down below again guys thank you so much for making it to the end of the video and i will see you all in the next video bye now i gotta go find the real batmobile like where the heck was that thing